Hey, what's going on, fellas? Welcome back, and man, I'm back again so soon. What's going on? Loving these uh, new 2024 releases early in the season here. To be honest, a lot of my favorite sets, why? Because they're, I guess, affordable. <laughs> they're not your average optic or prism prices. So, Luminance, one of my uh, favorite early sets, coming in around the $300 mark. Obviously, we'd like to see that around too, but I think we just got to accept it is what it is these days. Luminance is fun. It is a short rip. You're going to get 40 cards in here. There's four packs, 10 cards per pack. Got Jalen Waddle as the cover boy. We got a hit in every pack, three autos, one mim in these boxes. We are looking for on-card autos. I don't know if they're guaranteed or not, but I've got one every year. On display with me today, I got this uh, Jamar Chase rookie and Cooper Cup out of 10 there. Here's a checklist if you want to check that over. 75 base, 75 rooks. They are in college uniform. Looks like we got Elite coming out next week and then Certified right around the corner as well. I usually like to order a box of Elite, but I think I'm gonna just save up for Certified. I gotta have Certified. That's hands down one of my favorite hobby boxes of the year, like top two. So this should be last college jerseys. I don't see Legacy anywhere. That's usually college jerseys as well, so. Quickly, I posted this as a post on YouTube. I pulled this from a couple loose packs I bought from my LCS out of score. Mystery Rookies Redemption Mystery Rookie 1. I guess that's the most rare. I listed it on eBay, so if you're interested, go check it out. I am trying to do competitive pricing. When I first pulled this card, they were going for over a thousand. None sold, but all listed over a thousand. Someone just recently listed one for 800, so I dropped my price. So if you're interested, go ahead. We don't know what those are, but I could really use the cash. So if I sell that, I might even buy Elite too. I mean, who knows? All right, here we go. We got a slide out box and then it's gonna open up. Beautiful, beautiful. Love these cards. They're really, really good looking cards. I like what they did with them last year. They introduced new parallels. I really enjoy this product. They're, uh, again, they're college uniforms, so people aren't gonna like that too much, but here we go. Pack one, let's see what the base looks. Oh. Quite a bit different. A lot more shiny or uh, bright this year. Usually they're pretty dark. Bosa, O'Connell. And we should get a handful of numbered cards in here as well. There's ETN, two of 100, one off jersey number. Vestige, pretty cool. Here might be an auto. Oh, that would be sick if it was. CMC, 160 of 299. Cool foil on the cards. Really like that. All right, here we go. Here's an auto. 176. Uh, I don't really know college that well, so let's see. Chop Robinson. Okay, Seahop. Out of 700. 633 of 700. That's the highest numbering I've seen. And Devontae Adams, far out. That might be a new insert or possible case hit. I don't know. And then uh, our rookies, Blake Corum, Bo Nix, and Latu. Hey, you know what? I would not mind two numbered cards per pack, but usually it's, it's one and then you get two in one pack from what I remember. Here we go again. We got DK, Vestige, Base. Garrett Wilson out of 150, 96 of 150. Here's our second auto. For Mich oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, yes, he is live in here. Roman Wilson. I don't think that's bad, though. Trey Benson, rookie, 14 out of 100. And that Roman Wilson's number to 350. Hey, better autos so far. Not terrible. There's Chop, Bell, and Verse. All right, two to go. This one feels a little thicker. Um, Luminance also does have game used MIMS, which is random, but I always enjoyed that. I definitely thought that auto was JJ. That would have been sick. Here's a Bijan, or no, Zaire Franklin engaged. Pretty sick looking card. Old school. We got Jaws. Not from any specific game or event. What do we got here? 175, Tyrion Arnold. And Jaws is not numbered. 
little napkin there. Uh, another Bo Nix, Keon Coleman, and Jordan Whittington. Here we go, final pack. We're hoping for a solid on-card auto. Got some pretty weak autos so far. Ooh, that looks pretty cool. Really love the base cards. Fusion. That is not a case hit. That is pretty uh, common insert, but really sick looking this year. Uh, for USC, is that Mr. Rice? Uh, no, that is Mr. Branch. And that is not on card. Future Signatures. Um, I've heard of this guy. Not numbered. Hmm. That's a bummer. Spencer Rattler, 166 at 299. Gabe Hall, Byron Murphy, and Brian Thomas Jr. All right, hang on, boys. Before we get to the recap, recording this on my phone, I researched after I opened the box, far out Devontae Adams happens to be a case hit. And then these future signatures, the NIL, these guys are still in college. So I don't know what you guys think about that. Let me know. I feel like it's different. It's kind of cool. But at the same time, if we wanted to uh, get some college players, we could just open college product. Well, not our greatest rip, that's for sure. We did get six numbered cards, which is nice. For four pack, six numbered cards, you like to see that. Get CMC, ETN, Tyrion Arnold, Garrett Wilson, Trey Benson, Spencer Rattler. So three of the six were numbered rookie cards, which uh, you like to see that. Chop Robinson, Roman Wilson, and Zark. Uh, Zacharia Branch. And you know what? No, just initials for autos. I'd like to see that. And then this Jaws Mim. Um, we'll see. We'll see on the autos. Just got to hang on to those and hope one pops. I have heard of Roman Wilson and Zarka... Oh, God, I'm going to struggle with that one. Mr. Branch. So we'll see what their future holds. And that's it, guys. That's all I got. So if any of you guys are interested in that score redemption, go check it out. And then you can see me open Elite and Certified. Till then, I will see you guys next time. Peace.